All praises to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai. Double honors to the Apostle Elders of Great Millstone. And peace and blessings to the hopeful elect of the nation of Israel. The nation of Israel is so-called Blacks, Latinos, Hispanics, Native and Seminole Indians. All right. And uh, Israel is scattered around the world for the rest or the remnant. All right. And uh, it's just a quick sit down on uh, captivity. Us being in captivity and it's going to be payback to the other nations for putting us in slavery. So they're going to go in slavery. So this is Revelation 13 and 10. He that leadeth into captivity shall go into captivity. He that killeth with the sword <clears throat> must be killed with the sword. Here's the patience and the faith of the saints. All right. So the scripture goes in to say that whoever put one person into slavery, who like uh, not one person, but like for instance, you so-called white people put the blacks, the so-called blacks, Hispanics, the tribe of Israel, all right, Y'all put them in slavery. Y'all put us in slavery. All right? Y'all whipped us. You know, raped the women. You know, even men and children. Burned, burned us alive. Fed our children to alligators. You know, one-month-old babies I'm talking about. Two-month-old, 12-month-old babies. You know, so... You're going to go into captivity. And not just you white people, but all you nations. You Africans. You Arabs. Because you, you had the Arab slave trade. All right. The Chinese had us in uh, captivity. You know, we built the Great Wall. And the rest of the nations, y'all had us in slavery as well. All right. So, you killed us with the sword. So you're going to be killed with the sword, all right? And another scripture I'm going to go into. Uh, so I wasn't done, so like it. So the other scripture was uh, four, chapter 14, verse 12. Here is the patience and the faith of the saints. Here are they that keep the commandments of the Most High and the faith of Yahweh. Yeah, and like, and like uh, it said on the other scripture, here's the patience and the faith of the saints. The saints are the, are the Hebrew Israelites, all right? We're not black Hebrew Israelites. Israelites are going to be uh, from from all nations, you know? So we're not black Hebrew Israelites, all right? And with the saints, we're waiting on to put these other nations in slavery, waiting on for our kingdom. And ultimately, we're waiting on for the Lord, the Havish, to come back and save us, all right? So the other scripture I'm going to get is Hebrews 3 and 4. For consider him, Hebrews 12, so like he, verse 3 and 4. For consider him that endures such contradiction, talking about Yahweh of sinners, against himself, lest ye be weary and faint in your minds. Ye have not yet resisted unto blood, striving against sin. All right, so basically, we're going to be tried in times to come when the RFID chip is implemented, uh, well, mandated, uh, the economy collapse, you know, race riots, you know, so, we don't need to be weary. We need to be strong, you know. And it's just for consider him. Consider who the Lord. Consider how he handled the situation, how he uh, pulled through, you know. He bare his cross, basically, you know. And we have not resisted unto blood yet, you know. Nobody has approached us and said, you know, I'm going to pull the trigger 
if you uh, worship your God or if you uh, believe in your house by your outside and you say it, then boom, he pulled the trigger. We ain't been putting on no, no guillotine yet, you know. But it's cool. If we die for the Lord, that's, that's good. Because when he returns, we're going to be with him. Or you're going to be with him, you know. You're going to be risen first. Uh, what was this? No, I want to go to Matthew. No. Yeah, I, I go to... No, this is John 18 and... What verse was it? 18 and... Slide here. Man, it was 18... It was 18 and 12? No. It was, uh... Let's see. Damn. Let me get another scripture. Okay, Matthew 26 and 50. Okay. 